Uh, I want to thank uh, you, Madam Secretary, for all your years of, of service to, uh, to our government. I'm glad that uh, we have now got the uh, conversation going on an uh, infrastructure plan, and I uh, thank the, uh, the chairman for his work, and I'm very hopeful that we can move forward with a bipartisan plan here in, in this committee. I know the chairman wants, wants to do that. Uh, Ranking Member DeFazio does. I think we all do. So I'm very hopeful that we can, we can get that done. On the uh, infra grants, uh, I know there's $1.5 billion there. Uh, hopefully those uh, will get out in, in June and not, and not later. Uh, I know there's a project that uh, everyone knows I was talking about, CREATE, a rail modernization program in Chicago that uh, is 60, you know, 67 percent is both uh, comes from private funding, state and local funding. So I think that fits perfectly what the administration is is talking about. I um, hope to uh, see that funding come. Another big issue in Chicago is uh, public transit, and the needs are in the transit system. Our capital needs are are very very big. Um, the capital needs would account for. You know, 18 percent of the entire pot of federal funding in the uh, administration plan, the $200 billion. Uh, I know Mr. Uh, Larson had talked about the full funding grant agreements, the situation there. Uh, I wanted to uh, make a point in, in that it's important that transit does, is eligible for the funding uh, and that there has to be a way that uh, I believe that transit can get funded. It's very tough for, for transit to be able to come up with the 80 to 90 percent for a transit project, Lo locality come up with that. Uh, does the administration see those projects, transit pro projects, as being possible through the administration's plan? And if the uh, if Congress comes up with a, a different plan that is much more supportive of transit funding. Will the administration support that coming out of Congress? You asked very good questions. And number one, I would say we want to work with the Congress. So that is the basic premise. We do have a disagreement about uh, the amount of support for transit, but I would hope that we are open to discussing these projects and um, currently in the principles that are set, uh, sent up to the Hill, there is um, no disparaging you know, positioning of transit versus other projects. As if anything, once again, it leaves it up to the local and state governments to select what projects they want. So if they want transit versus something else, it's up to them. Thank you. It's going to be very tough to come up with the 80 to 90 percent on transit. But let, I want to move on to uh, uh, TIFIA and, and RIF. Yeah. Uh, which are very good programs, and I think the administration agrees with that. Uh, they have been undersubscribed, though. Uh, what is the administration going to do to make those more attractive, both TIFIA and, and RIF? Well, only one of them is undersubscribed. And so in the pr uh, infrastructure proposal, uh, there are recommendations to loosen up, some, to uh, broaden the eligibility so that uh, more parties can participate. And we think that uh, that would probably uh, allow more usage of those programs. So I know there has been an issue uh, with RIF uh, that has, has made it very, uh, has made it unattractive for uh, many of the uh, short line railroads to actually to use that, uh, but that's something we could uh, discuss further later. I want to follow up on, on RIF. The, the former administration, the Obama administration, said that they would follow Buy America policies for RIF. Uh, does the current administration also uh, believe in uh, that Buy America needs to be followed for the RIF program? I think this administration, this president in particular, feels very strongly about that. So we've actually been very, very tough on it, on the Buy America provision. It is not within the infrastructure proposal, if that is what's being uh, concer uh, discussed, but it is a overriding statute that all of us have to abide by, that and do abide. Thank you. I'll yield back. 
Thank the gentleman. 